So on this video, we are going to design the spring for our shock absorber. So a new part. Okay. So we sketch on the right plane. All right. We sketch a line from the point of origin. Okay. So this line represents the length of the spring. So I'm going to put it 120 mm. Okay, after that, we close. And then again, sketch on right plane. We sketch a center line. Okay. Smart dimension, we put it 20. This is the radius of our spring. Okay, and then we draw a circle. So the thickness of the spring, we put it 7 mm. All right, check. We close the sketch. Okay, and then features, we use shape both space. And then the profile, we select the vertical line and then on the option we are going to change specify this value the degrees we are going to change to revolution and then we put in a number of revolution so if we want eight revolution then eight revolution we want nine nine okay ten ten so let's say I put 10. Check. Okay. So we are going to insert plane in order to cut this excess on this side. So I want the top plane and then reference plane. We are going to select the top point of the line so we're gonna see we have to show first so meaning here we have got to show the sketch one show all right now top plane plane okay then we click the point all right so top plane is there check all right so on the plane we are going to go to the main menu and insert and we cut with surface okay so the direction we change now it's going down should be going up check so he cut the surface so you got the plot paste there of the spring okay so we select on the top plane and then we do the same insert cut with surface the direction is correct check okay so this is now our spring okay we change the appearance we go okay we go metal then we go steel right we select this one Okay, we select the red color one. Check. So this is our spring.